Hello everybody out there. Uh, my name is Scuba Bat Dan. I've uh, been on the ECF forum for about two years now. Um, I figured I'd come and talk about some of the stainless steel mesh that everybody's been raving about. Uh, I ordered mine from themeshcompany.com. This is the 400 stainless steel. I cut about an inch by an inch and a half out of this, rolled it, uh, heat treated it three times like everybody has suggested. Uh, you heat the end red hot, quench it in the water, do that three times. Uh, then it should uh, inhibit the electric, electric, electrical flow <laughs> through the necromium wire uh, when you hit power to it. Uh, this is my uh, quick change addy that uh, I've made and showed people how to make it on the forums. But this is pretty much uh, the stainless steel that's rolled up, replaced the silicone rope in it. Uh, use that uh, in conjunction with this, which uh, has batting material up inside of it. Um, basically, there's a plastic sleeve that uh, is kind of like a cup that's inverted. Um, so when you pour the liquid into this, the batting material soaks it up. You put this inside, uh, it wicks the liquid down to the heating coil and uh, works quite well. Uh, I would say highly recommend that the uh, stainless steel far superior to the uh, silicate rope uh, for the simple fact that it doesn't produce a burning taste uh, when used. Um, demonstration. Everybody likes demonstrations. As you can see, it performs quite well. And I don't get the burning sensation or burning taste that I would normally get with the silicon rope that it'd be in there. So anyway, I highly recommend the stainless steel. Uh, is definitely a uh, an alternative to the silica rope. Um, if some people I've seen haven't had really good luck with it, um, I would definitely recommend not using a lighter, but uh, either a butane torch or <clears throat> something similar that gives you a higher heat than what a lighter can do. A uh, lighter, I think, uh, will leave like deposits uh, on the stainless steel as opposed to just the high intense heat from a butane uh, torch and then quenching it uh, will throw impurities on this will inhibit the electrical path for the chromium wire. So, um, if anybody wants to see how I made one of these, there's a thread out there somewhere. <laughs> I, I've created too many so I can't keep up with all of them, but uh, I don't think I've got it in my, no I don't have it under my blog. I need to add that to my blog I guess. So anyway, that's uh, stainless steel. That's my thoughts on it. I uh, highly recommend you get it. Uh, it's very inexpensive. I ordered two sheets. They sent me five, so I got the bonus plan, I guess. So this is Scoob Bat Dan for the ECF. Uh, I'll see you guys later. Bye.